<laughs> How many elegant days are still unsipped? Tis a fraud, tis a fraud, I say, tis fraught with imminent danger, the coming of the fellow in the bright <coughs> nightgown. Deratted, goodbye stuffed fowl of a life foreshortened, Goodbye, rim of the glass of pure water forlorn. Goodbye, blonde pulchritude of far from travels. Daisies I shall not sniff, balls and not juggle. Goodbye, to the moment rather I shall endeavor to board the wagon, whose speed will win. Bumbly along the roads, parched tongue to the provinces. But you answer that, my good man, as a ship by some mischance of Minister Paprika. <laughs> <laughs> sitting and just breathe. I'm going to give up breathing and just die. I'm going to give up dying and just love. I'm going to give up loving and just right. Yeah. Yeah. And finally, I'll read you a poem. She wants me to read a poem that's not my own. No, I love that him reading. She likes the me, best. and only because didn't I read it here once before? No, never. Do I never both. did. No, the first night. Please read it. Do them both. Yeah. Please. <laughs> All right, I'll read it. it. Do it, Aggie. One. For this, it, I, for this I have to stand. Yes. Because this is not written by me. <laughs> <laughs> this is written by. Uh, Willie, uh, W.B. Yates, W-E-A-T-S. <laughs> no, I'll sit. Because I'm... Get over here. <laughs> no, this is All right, here it goes. Oh, Mark, you're here. You got your... That is no country for old men. The young in one another's arms. Birds in the trees, those dying generations at their fall. The salmon falls, the mackerel crowded seas. Fish, flesh, or fowl commend all summer long, whatever is begotten, born, and dies. Caught in that sensual music, all neglect monuments of unaging intellect. An aged man is but a poultry thing, mm -hmm. a tattered coat upon a stick, unless soul clap its hands and sing, and louder sing for all the tatters in its mortal dress. Nor is there singing school, but studying monuments of its own magnificence. And therefore I have sailed the seas and come to the holy city of Byzantium. All sages standing in God's holy fire, as in the gold mosaic of a wall, come from the holy fire, pen in a gyre, and be the singing masters of my soul. Consume my heart away, sick with desire, and fasten to a dying animal. 
it knows not what it is, and gather me into the artifice of eternity, once out of nature, I shall never take my bodily form from any natural thing, but such a form as Grecian goldsmiths make, of hammered gold and gold enameling, to keep a drowsy emperor awake, or set upon a golden bough to sing to lords and ladies of Byzantium of what is past, or passing, or to come. Oh, well. <laughs> <laughs> any, any other local talent who wants to get on the boat? He wants you, want you to do one more, more on your own. own. You, you gave us the eight. You were going to do one more yeah. on your own. Bye, bye, bye. Come on, come on, come on. Go to your broken heart. If you think you don't have one, get one. <laughs> <laughs> to get one, be sincere. Learn sincerity of intent by letting life enter because really you cannot do otherwise. Let it take you and tear you open like a letter sent, like a sentence inside you've waited for all your life though you've committed nothing. Let it send you up, let it break you hard. Broken heartedness is the beginning of all real reception. The ears of humility hear beyond the gates. See the great gates opening. Feel your hands going akimbo to your hips, your mouth opening like a womb for the very first time. Go singing, whirling into the glory of being ecstatically simple. Write the poem. Bravo. Bravo. Bravo.